Hey, hello my marketing brothers and sisters. Today I'm creating this uh, tutorial video to basically show you how I use PowerPoint presentations, how I leverage PowerPoint presentations to drive a good amount, a great amount of traffic to my website. You know, I know it's a very different way, very unusual, but trust me, it works, you know. And so, this is basically what I'm going to use the same article that you're reading right now. This is it. I'm going to, give me one minute so I can mark it for well, a couple seconds, not one minute. So I can mark it for you, okay? So you see this article that you're reading right now increase your website traffic to your article blog post by using PowerPoint presentations. I'm gonna use this article, you know, since that's the article I wrote it on, to basically show you how I use PowerPoint presentations and to drive traffic and how you can too. Alright? So now we're gonna get started. Now, okay, first thing I will do is I'll open my up my article and we're gonna keep this simple now. And before we do anything, I just want to uh, show you, like, uh, I, I put a list of websites that you could post to. Basically, these are the top, you know, websites that I use, you know, that I post to. And by the way, SlideShare and SlideServe is the best. And so I'm just going to use SlideShare for my example. And I'm basically going to do this live for you right now. And so this is the first thing I'll do. Once I post up my article, you know, I've already posted up. And... I, what I will do is I will look for four things to create my my PowerPoint with because I only do it for four slides. If, if you want to, you can even make it three slides, you know, because I try to keep it simple because the, the main point here is the traffic. We don't want to go into big slides and the whole point is the traffic. So first thing I will do, I just want to tell you that uh, I personally use Microsoft Microsoft PowerPoint. You know, I, I, I use Microsoft PowerPoint. As you know, that's from Microsoft Office and that's a paid thing but if you if you can't afford to get Microsoft Office right now then I had listed a free one wait let me see Let's see I listed a free one start using Microsoft Office okay oh I gotta go ahead and yeah well I forgot to put it in the article but I'm gonna make sure I will make sure that I put it in the article for you okay and it's, it's basically if you can't use Microsoft Office there's something called open office that you could use and I'm gonna show you right now and yeah this is it right here it's called open office and you'll be able to to use that open office right there and yeah it's basically an alternative to Microsoft Office okay but anyways let's get back uh, to the tutorial let's do this okay so I'm just gonna for the people that do have Microsoft Office so I'm just gonna go ahead and open my PowerPoint. Okay, I'm gonna go here and and just uh, yeah. open up my Microsoft Power Office PowerPoint. Okay, so that's what we're gonna use to make the PowerPoint with. And like I said, for the people that doesn't have Microsoft Office PowerPoint or not able to get it now. You can use the free one that I'm going to put in the article. Okay. Okay. So once I open up uh, Microsoft Office, the first thing I'm going to go ahead and do is, okay, well, it's giving me this Camtasia, but we're going to open up another one. Okay. All right. So once I open up my 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 oh, uh, Microsoft Power Office PowerPoint, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go choose a design. So I'm gonna go ahead over here, click on design, okay. And here is a list of designs, okay. I'm just gonna go ahead right here and choose a design. I'm gonna get this black one right here, okay. And I'm gonna go ahead and change the color a bit, change it up and. Ah, that's nice. Blue, my favorite color, so it's beautiful right here. All right. So now, once I get my design, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just go back to my article and I'm gonna add the title. I'm gonna come back here, copy and paste the title of the article. Okay. This is really simple. Ain't nothing to be fancy about or, or trying to do big stuff. It's simple. It, we the main point here to drive the traffic. So I come back here and I paste. I'm gonna just gonna go ahead and paste it. Paste the title of the article, okay? So now let's move the the title up a little bit. Don't so 
now okay all right we fixed up the titles and okay so for the subtitle all I do is I just take the link I just take the link of the of the auto when I put it because remember this link is what's gonna drive you to traffic this is link is what's gonna drive you to traffic you know because when people are looking at the uh, PowerPoint they're gonna be able to click this link it's gonna be clickable this thing I just added right here is a clickable link and I'm gonna show you once I submit it you're gonna see okay now one of the ways you can add a link to your PowerPoint is just like I did you can go directly to the article itself you copy and you pay you copy the link okay and you just come back here and you paste it you, or you paste it directly just like I did or if you want if or if you don't want the whole di direct link you just want to link up a, a word and make a word a, a link a hypertext a hyperlink so what you do is you, you select the word right once you select the word what you're gonna do is you go to insert okay and then you click on a hyperlink alright once you click on hyperlink you will add paste the link and you click OK alright and all of a sudden this is a link I just turned the word increase into a link so those are the two ways that you can put the link of your auto coin the thing but I don't want it uh, the word as a link I want the actual link itself you know so I'm just gonna remove the link but those are the ways alright so let's move on so now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna open up my next slide okay go to the home and get on my next slide and get this thing moving All right now I got my next slide so what I'm gonna just go ahead and do I keep things simple okay so I'm gonna just get something here some content here to find in the article that I'm gonna put in okay alright so okay here's what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna here take, take the keyword that I'm targeting okay see here's what I'm telling you I'm not trying to be fancy with stuff I'm just trying to keep things simple because what I do is I have a bunch of other uh, 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 traffic methods that I use you know to, to, to promote my articles so I can't just spend uh, all my whole life in one technique I have to because I have a whole other list I have to submit and do auto do like you know put my articles to so that I can get this thing going all right so you see what I did I just take the keyword that I'm targeting and then boom I just take this uh, heading one right here and I just paste it see trying just trying to keep things simple you know okay and don't forget most importantly copy and paste your link you gotta put the link in every slide so as the people read in every slide they have a link they can click to that's that's what because remember the main point here is to get the traffic that's all we're looking for is to get the traffic all right now I'm gonna just put on my next slide okay put on my next slide go back to the article and I'm gonna extract something all right okay I've been submitting them blah 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 is it to begin with okay all right so just to make things simple okay just PowerPoint presentations right here okay yeah I just take this take a little bit and Just paste it in there. All right, and go back. Take the link and paste the link in there. Remember, the link is the most important thing. You see how simple this is, man? I'm on my last slide right now already. <laughs> this is so simple like it's not even a joke okay all right so now let me just make up our next headline and then get this thing on moving okay no I just say driving the traffic so
See, most of the most of the time, I just uh, take something in, back, in the back of my head and just put it because as as long as I put a little bit of something in, that link is in there, and that's it. All right. So you see this four quick slides, and I don't even think it took me a minute. I mean, I don't even think it took me uh, uh, ten minutes to to set up this PowerPoint, man. All right, just paste that link in. Okay. Okay. Now we know we have all four links. We have uh, all links in all four slides. So now what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're just gonna save this slide. Go up. Save this slide. Okay. All right. Uh, okay. We're just gonna name it. Uh, uh, increase your website traffic with uh, PowerPoint presentations. All right. Here it is. All right, we're gonna do that. Okay, we're gonna save it in the documents uh, section. Save it. All right. So once you save your PowerPoint, now all you have to do is we're gonna go back and we're gonna go uh, to the site to submit our, our PowerPoint. This is this simple, guys. All right. Now remember to scroll down and and check out these sites because they're the sites that. There's more sites out there, but these are the top four that I use, so I just thought I'd give you the top four. And let me tell you something. SlideShare is very nice. I'm going to show you the results I get with SlideShare. And you're going to see this, how much traffic. SlideShare and SlideServe are the best. You know? You're going to see the results that I get, man, using a, a, a SlideShare, and, and, and it, it's just phenomenal. You know? I've gotten great traffic. Well, I'm still getting great traffic because I'm still submitting my stuff. So I'm just gonna go ahead and go to my uploads and let you see the results that I'm getting. See, as you can see here, 72 views. And you know what the best thing is? People are downloading your your PowerPoints. People are downloading it. Another 72 views. Come on, you cannot beat this. Look, 495 views. This is traffic at its best, people. Look, I'm gonna click on this, and you're gonna see how powerful this thing is. Because I have my link in this thing. People are clicking away and going back to my articles in this thing. Check this out. Look. This is the article I wrote building backlinks by using anchor text to comment on niche related blogs or websites. All I got to do is click that link right there. And it takes me directly to this article. Alright. I did this article a couple weeks ago. But it's doing well because, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm linked in the search engines. And, you know, I'm on the second page for this keyword. But... You know, it's, it's that's still you know a big a big thing because most people is you know. But anyways, yeah. So this is basically you know uh, 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 this this is the article I wrote right here, and as you can see, it's doing pretty well. And I know it's getting great traffic because I've set I've just set out the seeds there, and it's just been put up there. As you can see, I got a a couple comments you know which I'm really proud of. So, but anyways. You know, and also I had did this. Uh, I did this article, and I had uh, featured my my friend and one of my top commenters. You know, Yasha Haygood. You know, you most definitely want to check her out. Her website is yashahaygood.com, and me and Yasha are pretty good friends. As you can see, her website is a network marketing uh, blog, and I've learned so much. I used to be in network marketing, and I learned so much. Uh, reading her blog and and trust me, she's an expert. She knows her stuff. So most definitely check Yasha Haygood out. Yasha uh, Haygood dot com out. And yeah, so that's basically it. But as you can see, this article is doing pretty well. And I'm just gonna get back to this thing, like I had showed you. And look, you know what the best thing about SlideShare is? Look at this. I, I have uh, they let you tweet, they let you share your content, and also I have a lot of my SlideShare. Uh, slide share powerpoints that is actually ranked first page of google i have a lot of them that's ranked and so google calls slide share really nice because slide share is like a a, a a ranked a page ranked seven or eight website you know so this is very powerful and look at this all the backlinks are on here and each slide and i can just click away this thing got 495 views people you can't mess with that you can't play around with that, that that is like traffic at its best right there, you know? Traffic at its best. So I'm just going to show you some of the other ones. And you can see the results I'm getting for yourself. And 
to hopefully you jump on this thing fast because this is traffic. They got it, 96 views, you know, 90 views, like 124 views, you know, and, and, and the traffic doesn't take long for you to get. 118 views, 232 views, 192 views, you know, this is traffic because all these PowerPoints, I embed my link in there. Look at this, 346 views. All these PowerPoints have my link, the, the link of my article in it. So people, all they got to do is click. And all these people are traffic, clicking away and coming to my article. So now what we're going to do is we're just going to go ahead and submit. Uh, we, we're just going to go ahead and submit. We're just going to go ahead and submit this PowerPoint right here. You know? And so, yeah. Yeah, we're just going to go ahead and uh, submit this PowerPoint. And I'm going to show you the amount of you to how to do it. Okay, so we're basically going to go ahead. We're going to go to the document section. And we're going to go get the... We're going to go ahead and get the... Get Get the PowerPoint that we did, and we're just gonna start submitting it. Okay. All right. I'm searching for it right now. Ah, uh, come on, PowerPoint. Stop making me look too long for you. Okay. Okay, let me go back and save it again. Maybe I'm going to go back and save it again. Okay. Save it in the documents file. Alright, now we're going to go back. Okay, here it is. Increase your website traffic to article blog posts by using PowerPoint presentations. All right, here you go. And so now, once we uh, once we submit it, what we're gonna do is we have our, our title set up already. Okay. All right, now we're just gonna set up our tags and our keyword, which is increase your website traffic. And I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get. I'm definitely sure that I'm gonna get first page for this keyword. Okay. Increase your website traffic, website traffic, you know, just tag it up and, and website visitors, okay, and that's it. So now we just go back to the article, we're going to get a little description. For the description, just take the, the first heading one and put it on there. That's it. You know, this is it. So now... I didn't finish editing it, so now I'm I'm, just, I'm gonna go back in my uploads and and finish editing it. All right, so now I'm just gonna click here. 
you have to finish editing okay I've already submitted it is live now already it's live and then I'm gonna show you with the link how it's clickable and all that stuff but now we have to make sure we click we choose our categories and set it up in the right place okay so it's a how to we put it in the how to and always make sure that uh, people can download your file and that it's in public so we have everything set we gotta do is update this thing up okay All right. So now I'm gonna show you uh, this upload that I just did. Okay. All right. So now let's go. Let's 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 go see the the thing at work, man. This this beautiful thing at work. Okay. All right. Here goes the slide, and it looks beautiful. Blue, my favorite color. You know. And all I have to do, here comes the miracle, people. All I gotta do is click this link, and boom, it takes me directly to this article. And this is where your traffic kicks in, people. This is where it's at. In PowerPoint presentation, it may it may be different, it may be unusual, but trust me, it is a huge traffic source. I'm driving a lot of traffic with it. I'm raking up a lot of traffic, bringing a lot of visitors. You know, a lot of reads, a lot of comments using PowerPoint. And PowerPoint is only one of my methods, so this is only one of my methods, people. So, but it's a very great method, and I just encourage you to use it and and, and really use it to your advantage. And, and and the most beautiful thing about it is you can leverage it. Look, all I gotta do is tweet this, tweet this baby out. You always wanna make sure you do that. You always wanna make sure you do that. Tweet it out and let the world see it. You know, and just uh, Google Plus it share it on LinkedIn you know a lot of people make that mistake of not sharing their content first but you make the content and you can make sure it's very important that you share it first and put it out there first you know because it's really yours so you know before anybody else do it you do it first and so you just share it, you put it out there and this is just traffic it's being leveraged right now and as you can see I go I go to all the other slides I'm gonna I have the link I can just simply click it and it takes me right here to my back to my article so my friend this is what I wanted to show you I really hope you enjoy this tutorial that you use this to your advantage and so I'll see you on the next training on the next video thank you and bye bye